Good morning one and all. I hope you all are doing good and staying safe. Thanks a bunch for joining today's lesson. The theme for today is parenting with empathy. I hope it proves effective and lucrative for all of you. Today, let's empathize with our own kids. I have a small task for you all. Attached in the next section is a short story which will help you to understand and recognize your emotions in a better way. I request each one of you to become a child while you weave through the story. My body sends me so many signals to tell me how I feel. Sometimes I sweat, my stomach rumbles, it's hard to breathe. My heart races like crazy. Sometimes I want to jump for joy and then I want to yell or cry. But why, why, why? One day my mom said, I have a nice surprise for you, but you have to wait until lunch. What could it be? I just couldn't wait. I walked around the house, unable to concentrate on anything. I started playing with my blocks, but my brain just wouldn't stop thinking about the surprise long enough to build a tall castle. Then I got my train set out, but for some reason, the choo-choo just wasn't much fun. Next, I tried to use my toy tools to build the best race car ever. But my brain kept wondering about the surprise mom had for me. Boom, boom. My heart beat faster and faster. I felt ants in my pants. My skin tingled. I was so excited. I was so happy. I stood up straight. I held my head up, my eyes shined. I felt very proud of myself. I felt pain in my stomach. I wanted to hide. I was so scared. My grandma quickly pulled me back and hugged me. It is okay to be scared, said grandma. I was frightened too. I breathed out. My heart felt normal again. My knees weren't so wobbly anymore. I calmed down. It felt safe. My nose wrinkled up. My upper lip 
cold. My head shook from side to side. My mouth got all watery and I thought I might throw up. I was so disgusted. Grandpa stroked my back. Oh dear, he said. Let's go clean it. I pushed my sister and kicked that stupid table and I started to yell. I felt so angry. First, take 10 very deep breaths. Slowly breathe in through your nose and breathe out through your mouth while counting 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Instead of throwing or kicking things because of anger, just squeeze this anger in your hands and hold it there tightly. Then let it go. Instead of yelling or saying bad words, just say, I'm very angry. Instead of hitting someone, just walk away. Don't let your anger be your boss. Do you promise to try this next time? Yes, I nodded. I know you will said grandma and kissed me. You are such a smart boy. I get butterflies in my stomach when I'm nervous. I get so many of these feelings and they are all perfectly fine. Oh my God, didn't you realize the multitude of emotions we all experience? So parents, I have attached a short worksheet for you all. This will really help you to communicate with empathy with your kids. Try it out for once. And I shall see you next week. Till then, take good care of yourself.